Hi, amigos, amigas, amigues. How are you? It's live on KEXP. I'm your host, Albina Cabrera. You can find us at 90.3 FM Seattle, where the music matters, donde la música importa, and streaming worldwide at kxp.org and on our free mobile apps. All these sessions are made possible by donation from people like you, so thank you so much for your support. Muchísimas, muchísimas gracias. Welcome to another session here in Seattle and behind your screen. And I, ca I cannot be more excited to have a, one of my new favorite bands from Chicago joining us today. They released a new album this year in 2022 called Last Spot on Earth, uh, which I'm obsessed with, and I'm very excited to introduce their music to all of you. Divino Niño, here in Seattle and on KXP, bienvenidos. ¿Cómo están? How are you? Hey, super. Super? Yep. Nice. Divino Niño just finished um, their tour across the country a couple of days ago. Uh, your last show was here in Seattle with Little Jesus, so congratulations. And hey. uh, Divino Niño is here to share a couple of songs with all of you. So, si están listos? Ready? Vamos. Perfecto. Divino Niño, live on KEXP. Vamos. Another 
Divino Niño, live on KEXP. Slave para ver que acá Me apena pero quiero verte más No vuelvo a ti tan Slave para verte acá Me apena pero quiero verte más No vuelvo a ti tan Es que le digo dibujando corazones en trocos Con este cuchillo marcando nuestro amor Satánica romántica a mí me vale un huevo Si le brillan los ojitos yo le toco lo que puedo No me la paso en la revista Porque lo que brilla fácilmente yo no puedo encontrar Con agua caliente como rama y medio Yo me convierto en la gatula No me la paso en la revista Porque lo que brilla fácilmente yo no puedo encontrar En la casa me gusta tú y yo dos serpientes comiéndonos la piel Me vuelvo a tu tonto Quiero, quiero, quiero montarme en tu moto Me vuelvo a tu tonto Quiero, quiero, quiero montarme en tu moto Me vuelvo a tu tonto Quiero, quiero, quiero montarme en tu moto Me vuelvo a tu tonto Quiero, quiero, quiero montarme en tu moto Me vuelvo a tu tonto Este huevito aquí pa' ti, ma Este huevito Para verte acá Me da pena pero quiero verte más Me vuelvo a tu tonto Se me para verte acá Me da pena pero quiero verte más Me vuelvo a tu tonto Si tú quieres besame la boca Si tú quieres no podemos tocar la cosa Si tú quieres, besame la boca Si tú quieres, no podemos tocar la cosa Si tú quieres, besame la boca Si tú quieres, no podemos tocar la cosa Last Spot on Earth is the name of the last and new album of Divino Niño. And they are here live on KXP. Nada 
Tanto no late que me das su cachete Cagadita da la risa se hace que no quiere Uy, cosa es una otra Oh, yo no eres yo más Barra la onda de tipo mamarracha con el hilo Fumo un pipa, se miro las expresiones en los tiros Que me dicen que no estoy haciendo lo que te voy a hacer Ajusta la cabeza, no te pierdas en la web Divino Niño está en la casa, live on KXP. Disfruten.
You're listening to Divino Niño live on KXP. Thank you. KXP, that was amazing. Muchísimas gracias. Wow, estuvo espectacular. Thank you so much. Gracias a ti. <laughs> Songs from their last album, Last Spot on Earth, an album that, that came out in 2022, but was recorded during the pandemic, right? That's correct. Yeah. And let's start at the beginning. I want to know more about the band. So you started playing as a band in Chicago. Yeah. So how was it that everyone ended up being part of the band? I would like to know more about each of you. For real. Well, having have been playing in bands forever since we were like, I don't know, 12 or something. But then Guillermo and having and I were living together because we were going to school in Chicago. And then this homie is just added like later, like Pierce, we met him later, and then JV later. Just kind of beginning adding, adding up like that. Sí. Bueno, Divino Niño son Camilo Medina, Javier Forero, Guillermo Rodríguez Torres, Pierce Codina y Justin Vittori. Espero que lo haya dicho bien. Sí. Bueno, so on Foam, your album from 2019, we saw like a solid indie rock sound there, like some dreamy vibes, but an indie rock mostly, but this album is completely different. <laughs> so let's talk about that. Uh, first, what happened between both, uh, both uh, albums uh, that brought all these new sounds? No, for real. I think Foam uh, happened because we're like very involved with the Chicago community. We're going to shows and that's pretty much us like reacting to our environment, which is amazing. Like we love Chicago, but then during the pandemic, like all of that, um, I don't know, that community sense that we had kind of like faded away. So it was just the five of us bringing tracks in and like 
So the community, you know, in in a way became us in the internet. You know what I'm saying? We didn't have that anymore. So like, we were also going a little crazy. So you know, like that's just what we made. You know, like that's what happened. You know, us chilling. It's interesting because you recorded this album during the pandemic, but uh, I can feel a little bit of the of sounds for the dance floor in this album. I mean, I can hear references to Neo Perreo, to Trap, to experimental reggaeton. So I would like to to know like how, how was that incorporation of a style and how did you work that in the studio? No, for sure. I think like, um, I don't know, we had maybe a little bit of pent up energy from being at home so much. And we were like legit before recording sessions, we were showing each other like, showing each other reggaeton videos and we would just be like dancing in the studio maybe you know Guillermo and I are having you know like de depending who we were kicking it with so I think we were getting really hyped up before recording um that's as, as far as I'll say in terms of why how we brought that vibe into the new album but I can have like I don't know if any of y'all want to say how we worked it like engineer wise you know like yeah, yeah I mean that's pretty much it we just had so much energy we had to like you know let it out Yeah. And then we got introduced to, you know, energy drinks and... <laughs> <laughs> and uh, bueno, and how do you make the concept of last spot on earth and what that is mean to you? Um, I think, like, uh, at the time, I, I don't know, it felt really apocalyptic for, I don't know, not to be dramatic and stuff, but, like, uh, when we were making this... I, I almost felt like, I don't know if live music is going to come back. So I think we were spending a lot of time in cabins, uh, you know, jumping in the hot tub, so relaxing and partying a lot. And I felt like both of those, of those things helped me out a lot, you know, to like, uh, you know, I would take a bath once a week, you know, with like candles and stuff. And then we would like put dance music and dance really hard and they both felt very therapeutic. So uh, last on earth, maybe it's just like, yo, Let's relax, but the spa also is like a heavy ass party as well. You know, it's like super chilling, super party. Both extremes, nice and healing. <laughs> sí, sí, lo puedo sentir, lo puedo sentir. Um, and this album has another like, special or aspect to me, at least. It's mostly in Spanish. So um, I would like to know how did you make that decision and how did you work uh, in the lyrics? I think it came kind of organically because maybe a lot of the English stuff was also because like, oh, we're playing in Coles, Empty Bottle in Chicago. I want my homies to understand what we're saying. But now it was just like, well, we can say whatever, you know, and like um, we also I don't know, I to put it in kind of like a weird way. I, I you know, there was a time in Chicago where I was just like, oh, I want to sound like Sonic Youth or like my Bloody Valentine or something like that. But then we, like, discover, like, Miss Nina and Tomás El Real, and I'm like, yo, I want to be, like, a Miss Nina. Why am I trying to be, like, my bloody Valentine and stuff? So that's kind of maybe more of the vibe. But it wasn't, it wasn't like, everybody Spanish songs only. It happened kind of organically. And it's great about this time that it's not a new thing or super weird to sing in Spanish or to mix both languages, specifically in the Latinx community. Now it's como kind of super natural now. Right. Exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's kind of. Yeah. Yeah. So um, you and and also I want to be Tomás de Real as well. Of course. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, la mejor, Who la doesn't? reina total. <laughs> so you did a, a cover of Emil Horas by Los Abuelos de la Nada, como an anthem Latinoamericano of rock en español. Ah. One of my favorite songs, and I want to know more about that connection because I heard that uh, that song also in in your last show here in Seattle. Yeah. We've been closing with that song every show on this tour and even every tour this year, pretty much. And I think like during the pandemic, we also got really into just rock and espanol from the 90s and 80s, like, you know, like Mana and stuff like we have like a funny playlist of like uh, El Argentino, ¿cómo se llama? Andres Calamaro and todas esas cosas. So like um, that song just reminds us of like our childhood. I think like a lot of us heard it when we were young and um, it's just it has such a nice vibe. But then. I don't know, we wrote like a punk ending just because like it feels good to end the heaviest, like as heavy as we possibly can. It feels like really good. It was <laughs> so great. That's what's up. Me encantó, me encantó ese cover. And I would like to know more and also to do some kind of music recommendations. So which bands are you listening to right now? Mm, let's go. 
to recommend, like some alternative bands or oh, okay. Latin bands or I don't know. We got hella bands. Pieri, yeah, like, like Evolution of Neo Perreo or something. Pieri is really freaking good. I mean, it's, I mean, Isabella Love Story. I mean, you know, homies from like, you know, Spirit of the Beehive, The Garden, love them. Um, I don't know, Javi, Guillermo, come on, chime in. I just have a playlist and I can't remember exactly the exact <laughs> names, but I have DJ you know. PayPal. You know? <laughs> oh yeah, DJ PayPal. <laughs> Um, you know, Ariel Satina, like Ariel Satina from like Chicago, great DJ. Um, you know, our, our friends Roya, you know, they're great DJs as well. There's a lot of, I mean, we've been listening to a lot of DJ stuff lately, but um, yeah, I mean, I, I imagine all the Neo Perra stuff, people know it, but like we love all that stuff as well. You know, like I already mentioned it, but like, yeah. Tomas Al Real and like La Zoe, Lagunichonga from Miami. We went to high school with Lagunichonga, which is pretty sick. Um, I don't know if you all can think of anything else, but that's kind of what's on the list for now. Bueno, recomendaciones eh, by Divino Niño. And you just finished a tour around the country here in uh, Seattle. And so what's next now? <laughs> I'm going to sleep for a thousand years. <laughs> <laughs> yes, right? You need it. Do you have fun here in the Pacific Northwest? Um, yeah. yeah, so beautiful. One of our favorites. Oh, so beautiful. Really? Good. Yeah, I yeah. nice. love it. It's gorgeous. Yesterday was like, it felt like our first day off in a year or something. Like, we walked around, like, we had some Korean food, like, whatever. We had a great time. <laughs> like, Can we love it here, legit. <laughs> Thank you so much, Tikus, for being here with us, for stopping by at KXP. It's a pleasure to be with all of you. So, Thanks for this time and for the session. Oh my God, thank you for thank having you. us. We had a blast. Que lindo. Uh, and thanks all the team for making this session possible. Divino Niño live on KEXP. And thank you for listening and watching all these sessions. And if you want to find more sessions, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. All these sessions and the vision and the content of KXP are made possible by donor support. So thanks a lot for your support. You can go to kxp.org slash live and make your gift. Like any amount makes the difference. Muchísimas gracias. My name is Alvina Cabrera y nos vemos pronto. Divino Niño, live on KXP. Adios. Discover great music at kexp.org.